Hello everyone, my name is the LEGO Kid 2003 and uh, today we are playing some Genshin Impact. In the last episode, we started working on the Lost Riches event and kind of messed around with that and we've saved up enough iron uh, uh, enough ancient iron coins to get the Sealy, but we can't get it until we uh, explore the last treasure area. So that's basically what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be exploring the last three treasure areas that we have and adopt the, uh, the Celia at the end. So yeah, and I already have everything nice and set up, game's running, audio is nice and set. So, without further ado, let us begin. And one thing that I was doing in between streams is starting to build Mona. If you guys have watched through my Golden Apple, Golden Apple Archipelago uh, streams, you'll know that I'm... You'll know the specific reason why I hate Mona with a passion. I'm starting to get over that, and I'm coming to the realization that if I am getting constellations for her, I might as well put them to good use. So... Yeah, off camera, I'm slowly going to be building Mona and eventually incorporate her into one of the uh, the ten teams that I can have. Uh, she's not going to be in the Winds of Revolts. That is, that is saved for very special characters that have a very special place in my heart. For example, Siao is a simp for him. And Bito is in his own separate team because he works best alongside Goro, who is uh, well suited for a solid Geo team. So anyways, uh, without further, without too much more delay, let's bust open, let's uh, break open the map, head to Sumeru, and try and figure out where the uh, where the next treasure area is. I already have the treasure seeking Sealy equipped, so we can jump right into it without issue. <laughs> I say as it <laughs> ends up getting a slight connection error and it's not responding twice. There we go. So yeah, Mondstadt, Liua, Sumeru. Okay, so I'm wagering... I actually did take a look at the picture before we started, and I think it's going to be right around here-ish. So let's head over here to this statue, turn in the Dendroculus that I have, because I do have one in my, uh, in my inventory. And then, uh, then I go from there. And then get my, get my little friend. Yeah. Yes, I am fully aware that I have Discord open behind Genshin. It's fine. But yeah, while I'm waiting for this to load, I'm going to bring all of y'all's attention to the two meters right below me. The one in blue is my follow goal. And if we reach 150 followers by year's end, yeah, by years, yeah, if we reach 150 followers by year's end, I'm going to play Deltarune for the first time. Now, the uh, empty green meter down there is my subscriber goal. If we hit 100 subscribers by the end of the year, I'm going to do a stream in a maid outfit. I'm not kidding. This is not to bait people into subbing. This is not to trick you guys. I will actually do a stream in a maid outfit. I am dead serious about that. Because <laughs> a true king stays true to his word. And I'm the king of rebellion, so I'm sticking to my dang word. So, if the rain meter fills up, I do a stream in a maid outfit. And if, for, and if by some catastrophic miracle... <laughs> These two meters fill up at the exact same time. 
then the resolutions will stack, and the first uh, episode of Deltarune will be in a made outfit. Yeah. <laughs> so, if you're watching this and you haven't followed yet, click the button. Click, click at the very least the follow button. The, the, the following is free. Subscribing is, yeah, so, uh, Twitch, su Twitch subscriptions are paid services, but there are plenty of benefits to doing so. Uh, first among them, you get a cute little badge. Uh, next to your name, so that everyone who's watching, and yeah, so that I and whoever is watching the stream and taking a look at chat can see that you have subscribed successfully. And I'll give you a fun little uh, shout out once you do so, and same thing for the followers. You follow me, I give you a shout out. Another thing is that you have access to emojis, which is very important because the emojis for this channel tie into the channel's main gimmick, which which will work wonders in this game. And it basically allows you to spam a specific emoji to increase my streamer luck. That's that's basically what it what it is. And that window will last for 15 minutes. And the effects will last till the end of the stream. So you have a 15 minute window to spam the specific emoji to increase my streamer luck. And then however much my streamer luck increased by, it's going to stay that way for the remainder of the stream. So, yeah. <laughs> that, is, that is basically it. So, yeah, you get badges, emojis, you can take part in the gimmick, and you get to be held responsible. <laughs> you, you get to be one of the fun people that gets to, <laughs> that ends up causing me to wear a made outfit for a stream. What better reward is there than that? Ignore that. But yeah, click the uh, subscribe with Prime button, and you will get your free one month sub. Uh, if you don't, then you'll be paying money, and for goodness sakes, <laughs> you're already paying money for Twitch Prime, so I don't want you spending money for anything else. So yeah, I don't, I don't know what was. <laughs> I don't know what was up with the uh, with the stream there. It's definitely going through some issues. The, the game is going through issues. Oh no. Oh, this isn't good. That's not good. Okay. I'm kind of out of things to talk about. Can you can you please load? For me, please. Pretty please? Pretty please with chocolate on top? Come on, you can do it. And uh, also in the last... In the last stream, I already decided on which Sealy I'm going to get, so yeah, my my, my decision is set in stone. I'm I'm getting the I'm I'm getting the green mini the green mini Sealy, because it kind of it, it fits my team's aesthetic, especially since half of my team since half of my team is Animo. Which is kind of like a bluish green teal kind of color. And also I have the Dendro Traveler on that team, so it just makes the most amount of sense to grab the Moss Sealy. But yeah, in all honesty, like 
it's frustrating, but it makes sense. Um, the fact that you can't get the A mini CLE until the end, until you complete the event. Because you want people to enjoy the events in its entirety, and the main reason that people take part in Lost Riches is to get the CLE. So if you allow them to get the CLE before they complete the event, then they won't have any more incentive to take part. So, I... <laughs> Oyoverse thought of this. Oyoverse definitely had this in mind. Okay, there we go. There we go. See, that wasn't so hard. And also... Uh, also, I loaded the game before I started the stream, so any lag that I get here... So, yeah, any lag that you guys are seeing, I'm getting too. So, don't worry too much about the, uh, about the presence of lag, because it will eventually go away. It's just gonna take a bit. So, yeah, let's quickly heal everybody up. Oh yeah, revive Bennett. I forgot. I, I forgot that Bennett ended up dying off camera, uh, while I was playing. Ooh, you know you're in trouble when your healer goes down. And in all honesty, like, a healer on my team is so ridiculously important because of, uh, Seattle's burst. Yeah, it makes him super strong and converts pretty much all of his raw attack into animo damage. But it also drains his health over time. <laughs> so... Having a healer like Bennett with you is so, so important. And it will basically make or break your gaming experience. And of course the attack boosting effects that Bennett's, that Bennett's burst has is super useful as well. Because that just means more animo damage for you. So, yeah, I need five more Dendroculi to uh, get the statue to level four. And then these are the, the rewards that I can get. So, yeah, let's quickly... Let's look at the, the picture and see... No. We're not doing phase trials right now. Yeah, I'm, I'm in the right place. So yeah, I'm like ar around here-ish, so I just need to head towards the river and then I'll be inside the uh... Reduced to just standing around. How absurd. The uh, area of effect. Trust me, eventually this will stop where we don't have to deal with the game not responding properly. It'll, it'll, it'll happen eventually. How long that's gonna take, I don't know. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. Because that would be a bad time. Cause cause my streams are scuffed by default, so. Oh don't tell me we're gonna get the little arrow thing, but the second I move more to the left. Yep, there we go. I knew it. I knew it was gonna happen. How do I know these things? Thankfully, I know how to fix it. Line it up. River. Go to the character menu. Wait, 
wait for the game to respawn. to bring up the character menu, and then we'll be fine, and we'll be right on track to fixing that. We'll, we'll be on track to fix that. And also, this isn't exactly fully pertaining to, um, to Genshin, but it, but Splatoon 3 does release tomorrow, which I'm super excited for. And pretty much to celebrate, I am going to be finishing up the Octo Expansion. Basically, it's a special event stream where I'm not going to stop until the Octo Expansion is done. Uh, there's a ruin thing. There's a big boy. All right, I'm in. Yep, enter treasure area. Summon the treasure seeking Seely and help it absorb energy. I really like the music. It's very nice. It's very soothing. Like, in all honesty, I could listen to the music all day. So I'm gonna go this way, away from Mr. Sc uh, from the scary robot over there. Alright, so summon the ceiling. Again. So another fix I have is to right click outside, left click in, and that also fixes the so there are basically two counters for the uh for that specific error for Genshin players who are on a PC. Go to the character menu, left click once. Exit the character menu, or you can, if you're windowed like me, you can right click outside the window, left click in, and that will also fix the issue. I don't know any permanent solutions beyond to just never blank the game again. And that's not a solution I'm going to be uh, partaking in. Where is the Oh, there it is. No, I missed. Shoot. All right, let's let's try that again. Let's let's try that again. Where did it go? Oh, so it's right there. So what I can do There. I can just use Seattle's burst and go from there. Bam. Quest complete. 
So yeah, we're, uh, the ping. The ping is ridiculous. Grab the peaches. And then it's right by this Aranara here. Material collecting Aranara. Seely seems to have located a treasure area. Well, if the game would load, then I could go there. Spider-Man, because that just make my that might make my computer explode. So yeah, collect the men. Thirteen minutes in. Grief. Yes, I fully recognize, I know. Eventually, the arrow will be fixed. Eventually. Oh gosh. Oh, there we go. So that's, that's how we build something. Okay, are we good now? Combat or collection? Alright, it is neither? Oh, it's collection. Let's if it's collect useful, everything I'll inside. Take it.
don't tell me we're near a withering zone. No, no, no. Let's not. Let's not. Not today. I don't want to deal with the withering right now. Yep, it's the withering! Saying it's up more, so. Oh, I have no choice but to Spider Man. Here we go. Please don't hate me, computer. What's it gonna. Ah, shoot. Well, that's not what I wanted. the withering zones that have yet to take shape. You can use this method to stop the creation and expansion ahead of time. These objects can also be activated using Electro. Interesting. Very interesting. Anyway. Let's leave the withering zone. Collection or combat? It's combat! Let's immediately set up Kazuo's burst. As one with wind and cloud! So we're gonna have the uh, mushroom continuously take damage. So that my computer will hate me even more. Ow. See ya. Evil conquering. Tear. Come on. Holy cow. My computer hates it when I do these combat challenges. 12k, nice. I literally have to... <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to complete it. Yeah, it's, it's not a possibility for me to complete this combat challenge first try, especially if my computer keeps lagging like this. It's just not within the realms of possibility. It's, it's not gonna happen. Like, 
Like, I'm more than... So yep, I I'm running out of time. It's... Yeah, see? Like, I I'm not gonna have time. You are a cheater. Right now, I'm going to Germinate. do this. Immediately set up travelers first. Have my computer hate me. Yeah, see that wasted like a good 10 seconds. Also is a little easier on the on the computer, so let's just use him. Just a little bit. Yeah, see I'm going through it much faster. Just using Kazuha. Instead of being all complicated with the setups. Did you not give me energy? Oh, sorry. Bam. Fallen leaves adorn my night. Wind Strider. to Xiao. Getting it close. Bam. Challenge complete. Good grief. There's quality here. Guide to admonition, huh? Alright, so another thing is over here. shows up, I'm just going to deal with it, and go about my day. That is what I'm going to do. And of course, I'm continuing to save Prima Gems to gather up as many wishes as I can so that when Kusanali's banner arrives I can pour everything that I've saved into getting the Dendro Bean.
course the air- oh, it's super, super close, okay. Or combat. What you got for us? It is collection. Shoot. I already messed up. Okay, um. Catapulting me into the air. Stop. Okay, there. Now I return over here. Nice and peaceful life. Treasures in this area it's have been uncovered. Concerned. Oh, hush face trials. So, yeah, we're, we're getting this one at the end of the event. Alright, so it seems like the next area is kind of near the castle. So, alright, it's in the Avidia Forest. Ooh, I. Okay, I. Oh, I recognize this area. Are we going to Gondarkville? Reduced to just standing around. How absurd. I think we're I think we're going back to uh, Gondarkville. Yeah, we are. Oh, that's so cool. All right, so let's teleport over here. see I like how the theme count has been extended from four to ten because it makes customization a little bit easier and it means I don't have to mess with teams as much it's really cool I know I'm like just trying to feel the awkward silence while I'm just waiting for it to load You know, I'm scared for my computer when uh when four point arrives. Oh my! I have, <laughs> I have a feeling that if I uh, try playing Genshin in four point and beyond, my computer's just gonna explode every time I try to load the game. So summon the ceiling. There we go. There's a thing of energy off to the east-ish direction. So I'm sure that we're not going to fly an Asher. Yeah, let's go 
Let's let's look up and make sure that we're not gonna end up passing it by accident. The damned will sooner die again than lay a All right, hand so on me. Alright, so it's down. It's 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 <sighs> down. Alright, I can actually see two things of energy. So there's one here and then there's one over there. So that's two right there. Once again, right click out here, left click in here. Also, I don't want to bother the Ar the Aramites, because I'm in the middle of something. Paimon, I love you, but good grief. Let me treasure hunt, dang it. I'm just gonna go for her for this one over here because that's the one that I saw first. mind about getting the other one, we're getting this one. So I immediately forgot where the other one was. There's a thing. The actual treasure area is right here. Grab the mushroom. It's here and it's up so. Collection or combat? Collection or failure of the Yuka. Combat! Okay. Cloud so, do that. Bang. Switch to see how burst it up. And my Seow is triple crown, so you... Won't survive. <laughs> Try attacking me, I dare you. Not my concern.
No, 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 no. There. That would have been a bad time. That, that, that would have been the bad times. Oh, and if any of you guys have uh, advice for building Mona, that uh, would be very much appreciated. Because I've never built Mona before. Because, you know, she's been pretty much unbuilt since I got her. So, what I'll probably do is uh, have her built as a sub-DPS. So that I can use her if I have to. But not to a point where I'm, like, relying on her like I would a support. Hmm. Alright, we have a treasure spot right over here. Treasure spot number two, I think. This is number two, right? I, I lost count. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is, uh, spot two. There's another thing of energy right there, so once we're done with this, we can immediately... Oh, great. More combat. Teamwork is dreamwork! Disappear. Boring. Ah. Uh. <laughs> So he's causing him to take these guys out. Wind strike. Bam. Challenge complete. I'm, I'm honestly getting better at this, I feel. Alright, so there's still one more. And then it's... No, it's uh, number six, and then we are done with the event. So let's quickly... Uh, let's light it up! Let's quickly do this. Burn this. There. And backtrack for the next one. Next bit of energy. I just saw it. <laughs> and I just missed it too. Okay, where else? Where else? Oh, Samara Rose. What the parts are? Oh, that's the Samara Rose. Let's see, let's scan the area and try to find one more thing of energy. Oh, there we go. Right on cue. Huh. 
I'll take you on. I don't even have to use my full power. Tiny mushrooms. Yeah, I'm not wasting a burst on this on this one tiny. sounded like but trust me I was not trying to actually say that I was trying <laughs> I was trying to say bit and a treasure at the same time all right combat or collection collection This one. Treasures in this area have been uncovered. Where's number six? Are right, not far from uh, Samara City. Wow. Yep, this is the. Uh, all right, so it's in the Appen Woods, a little bit south of the main city in this area here. Okay. Uh, while we're here, let's quickly uh, get the uh, the Prima gems that we can snag. Cost 160, so we will. Most certainly have enough to, uh, yeah, we'll, 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 we'll have enough. And then let's also get, yeah, let's get the Heroes Wit too. We can always use more of that. There. And then, no more spending until we get the mini sealy. Then I can uh, use up all my ancient coins and go from there. just standing around. How absurd. Alright, Appen Woods, Appen Woods. Oh, wait, nope, I lied. <laughs> it's, it's not near the city, it's near, it's near this place here. The city is all the way up here. I, I, I got, I, <laughs> my apologies, I, I got that mixed up. That's, that's, that's my bad. So yeah, let's go to this statue of the seven here. I know no one have redeemed the hydrate thing, but I just wanted to drink some some uh, Vanta for the sake of victory and also just self. Imposed hydration. Oh, Esther's playing Minecraft. I might watch. 
watch that later. Possibly. I think I'm probably, I'll, I'll watch it later. I will, I will watch it later. Alright, so we're not there yet. Okay, so... Uh, Alright, so if we go a little more south, then we should be inside of it. We, we, we should be inside of the, uh, the treasure area. Just, 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 just a little south. Those memories. Just, just a tiny bit. It's so dark. Seal's head. Uh, this way. Have my computer hate me for a few seconds. That sounds about right. Demons do not just, stop just... for the raid. Move. Oh, that's right. Alright, there we go. Oh, not again. that bad. Wind strike. Why? <laughs> um, no. Yes. Stop. I, I honestly forgot what I did specifically that, um, that stopped them. But you know what? Typical fallback, go into the character menu and then exit after a few seconds. That, that typically helps. Why? Just why? Alright, fine. I'll... I'll, I'll let you do it. Fine. If, if, the, if you want it. I'll, I'll just make it look like I'm the one moving the character, and the character is not just moving on its own. Oh, there we go. I just needed to, <laughs> I just needed to give it a little time. Let's get onto solid ground, summon the Sealy, and do the, uh, and just take out the, uh, last few areas. Alright, so now we're in. Mini Sealy, go! But I was just over there. Well, not quite.
Oh, there it is. How am I supposed to... Oh. Like that. See? Cause was useful. Cause was useful. He's great. Uh, that's the poison mushrooms. I hate those. Uh, I don't like dealing with these. Oh gosh. Alright, so looks like we have a treasure area. Oh gosh, not again. That's fine. Is any problem solved? Alright, where is the uh, treasure area? Oh, there it is. Found it. Alright, collection or combat? It's combat time! Alright, so let's set up the decimation field. That I has. So yeah, the... Uh, no, that's not what I wanted you to. Oh wait, no, the thing already transformed, so we're fine. Ah, I'm frozen. What anyone wants? Oh, forget it. It's not my concern. Let's just peacefully climb on up. Gives the next bit of ener energy. Not deal with the uh, the Spider Man stuff. Yes, it's literally a straight. Uh, it's a withering zone. It is a. Ah, shoot. I guess those. <laughs> 
I, I guess the mushrooms didn't want me to make a straight joke. Fine. Would, would you rather me say it's a gay shot? Little, little mushrooms? Because if, if, I, if I say that, then that just makes no sense. Oh, I know, it's back up this way. Never mind. It's over here. Somewhere. Where is it? Where's the... Oops, there's some energy. Oh, here it is. Yes, it is! It is collection! Where do I need to... That's, uh, there. I, I, I need to go here next. I basically just wasted my time being confused. There's quality here. All right, two of three. Hunt continues. I know that there's uh, another thing of energy nearby. Oh, look, there's Demons one here. do not stop for the raid. Move. It's <laughs> already planning on moving hot stuff. Okay, uh, and then there's a second one right here. Then Draculus. Donde? Donde esta? Donde esta el Dendroculus? Ah, uh, here you are. schedule program. <laughs> Called, I fumble around looking for treasure for two hours.
Where's the last treasure area? It's over here. It's right this way. Okay. And I might do some, uh, split in free coverage. I don't know. Is it collection or combat? It's combat, my good friends. Disappear. Immediately burst up. Wait. Chest. Bam. There's quality. All here. treasures in this area have been uncovered. And then I have battle pass stuff. It's BP period. Yep, uncover all treasures in treasure area six. Done. And that means it's Celia adoption time. Hi, Koi! You just joined at a good time. Because I'm about to adopt a Sealy. Forgive me for this. What? What are you gonna do? No. I'm not getting Sorkama. To just standing around. I'm not. Alright, first up, watch your language. Second up, I'm not getting the Sorkama. I'm not getting Sorkama. I'm getting Moss, and that's final. But it's a social norm. It is a social norm to get Circama for your first time around in this event. I know you're sad that I'm not adhering to the meme. If I get Circama, what's in it for me? <laughs> what do you have on offer that'll make getting Sorkama worth it? Bits. <laughs> Thank you for the uh, bit, Koi. You know what? Fine. This promise overrides the original. I'm- I'm fine. I'll get Sorkama. Fine. I'll get- Are you absolutely sure you want me to get Sorkama, though? Are you absolutely positive? Because I will have to wait until 4.0 if I want to get another one. Alright, here we go. There we go. Mini Sealy Sorkama. Let's get more because I'm poor. 
Let's just let's just blow what remains of my Mora. Uh, of the uh of the iron coins. There. There. There, many many CLD Circuma. Are you happy now? In all honesty, the mini sealies are are cute, no matter what color you get, so it's fine. Switch. Bam. There you go. <laughs> there you go. There's there's your there's your peely. There's there is your. There's your meme CLA. It's honestly adorable though. <laughs> I was not fully expecting to W Strain Market Creation. I wasn't fully expecting to finish the, uh, the quest <sighs> this quickly. Because I still do have, like, a little over half an hour left. So... You know what? Let's let's work on building Mona. Let's let's just do it. Let's just, let's just work on building the astrologist. Let's let's do it. What do I need? Is it a th nope? It's not a Thursday domain. Looks like fate is on my side. <laughs> Looks like fate is telling me to not build Mona right now. But yeah, at some point I'll have Mona properly built and on a team. I don't know what team just yet, but I will have her on a team. So, while I'm here, what should we do? What should we do? Oh gosh, what did I just press? Story quest, taught her tales, and then I still have all those. Um, let's turn on Tignari's uh, story quest. Let's let's do that. Yeah, so I'm going to uh, start the story quest. Uh, Kazuha, Mona, Chongyun, and Benny for my main team. Ooh. That's honestly a pretty good team to have. Because you can literally just stack all of their bursts together. And strengthen your team while, damn it, while uh, making it worse for the enemies. And that's kind of what I have for my team. Instead, I only need three bursts to stack. So, yeah, let's... Yeah, you, you haven't gone to see Catherine in a while, wanted to have a look. So let's, let's start on Tignari's story quest and get as far in as we can before our two hours are up. Meaning we only have like half an hour and I, it's, oh goodness, and story quests are hardly ever half an hour long, like, story quests are not half an hour long, they will take you about an hour at the very least. So, uh, the next strain, the next Genshin strain that we do, will uh, we'll be finishing it up. And also I'll be able to unlock some very commissions today.
Oh, yay! Oh, I'll be able to do that. I'm just gonna throw it in the trash. Oh, I'm waiting. Right. Okay. See so, yeah, this will be. This way we'll be able to take our Sealy for a bit of a test drive. Uh, a little tester. A little tester here. One of the reasons why I... An ugh, another reason why I didn't really want Sorkama is because it doesn't fit the aesthetic of my main team. So it's, it's yellow. And none of the characters on my team actually wear yellow. Like, if, if we go to Bennett, for example, there isn't really any yellow on him beyond the little, uh, thing on his arm. That's the only thing that's yellow on him. Traveler! All the stuff that's yellow-ish is more like a pale gold, so it kind of fits, but not really. Kazuha is mainly browns and uh, like autumn colors. And then we have Mr. Emo Man himself. Not a single speck of yellow autumn. And all honesty, I kind of like the irony of it. <laughs> like the fact that it just does not match the aesthetic at all, but it has not looked there. I can't really do anything about it now. When it's done, it's done. It's still cute. Come on. It's an easy job, isn't it? Oh, Traveler, you've come at a good time. Hey, Catherine. Oh, yeah, I have to turn on auto. Wait, Oops. this sounds like another commission. Yep. <laughs> it is as you say. The commission this time around is of high importance. It pertains to the safety of the Avidia Forest's inhabitants. Huh? What happened? Ooh, I noticed that we're not wearing the, uh, not long ago, Akasha Terminal. We received word that a section of the Avidia Forest seems to have become contaminated. Withering zone? Contaminated? You mean a new withering zone? Maybe. I don't know about the specifics. But I hear that strange things are happening to people who cross through that region. Hmm. Interesting. The Avidia Forest inhabitants won't leave their home so easily. If we allow this contaminated region to expand, the consequences could be unimaginable. That's why I want to ask you to investigate the situation. Even if all you can do is stop the contamination from spreading, that will still save many people. This is forest business. Hmm. Maybe Tainari will know something. Let's go find him. Yeah. Let's let's go. Let's go find the cute fox man. We'll be added to standard banner. Uh, either. What about green? Yeah, I was planning on getting green. That's that's the very thing. I was, I was going to get green, but you wanted me to get the... Like, green would match the aesthetic perfectly, which is what I was initially going for, but... As, as I was telling you... Just want to take commissions. Didn't say that. You must be well acquainted with the Adventurer's Guild's way of operation. I won't waste your time going over it. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me at any time. Next year, man. Yeah, I'll I'll get the green one next year. Lost Riches 4. Okay, great. So yeah, now we can accept commissions in Sumeru. Finally. Yep, Sumeru. Bam. The commission quest region has been changed. The changes will take effect in the next reset. Yep. Reduced to just standing around. How absurd. Oh, 
right, reputation rewards. Uh, let's actually do that. Let's take care of reputation stuff. Real quickly. Unless white. I am not getting a white Sealy. That is asking for it. That is asking for all the jokes. I am not, no. I am, <laughs> I refuse. Um, shoot, where's the, where's the, where, good grief, where's the reputation guy? Okay, so I can go to this waypoint. In all honesty, if, if there is, for some reason, a white Sealy, a, a white mini Sealy, I'm not getting it. No. That is... A catalyst for too many jokes. No. I'm I'm getting green next time. I'm getting the green one. No one's gonna stop me. Amounts of bits, donations, or otherwise are gonna stop me from getting the green one next time. Worthless. So yeah, let's turn in. Hi. So let's turn in all of the uh, reputation stuff. Going in here, let's reactivate the story quest. Doesn't serve any practical use, but it's it's adorable. It is so unbelievably cute. I love the mini Sally. Small child. Shh. Keep your voice down. I will if you let me touch your ears. Tainari. Everything's spinning. Am I going to die? <laughs> tell mom that I should have listened to her. I mean, not to be a and negative Nancy, but Suda everyone dies I'm someday. I'm sorry for breaking her toy. I didn't tell her because 
I was scared that she wouldn't play with me anymore. Tainari, I heard that people turn into birds after they die. Is that true? I feel like I'm certain cultures, getting yeah. lighter. What happened? Tainari, is he? Okay, okay, <laughs> okay enough stream. nonsense. You just have a small fever. Take your medication and rest. You'll be bouncing off the walls in no time. Really? Then can you keep the thing about the toy a secret for now? No can do. You're a big kid now. Once you've recovered, go and apologize. Keeping secrets to yourself won't solve anything. Oh. Yeah. Hey, let me ask you something. I recall that you're usually pretty healthy. How did you get this sick all of a sudden? I don't know either. Mom's been telling me not to play in the forest. I just wanted to look inside. It's different from before. I got lost and went around in a huge circle. After I got out, I, I started feeling dizzy. Could it That's be? called dehydration. Maybe it's the contaminated region. The contaminated contaminated region. Maybe it's dehydration. Who knows? Hmm. It's one of the two. It's either contaminated so region that could be a withering zone or dehydration. Anyway, go rest. No running around until I say so, got it? Traveler, Paimon, let's step out for now. Fine. Hold on a second. Tashi, you're supposed to be dealing with this region. Mr. Forest Watcher, how is my son? I gave him some antipyretics. Let him rest here for a while. I told him that he would feel better after some medicine and rest, but... I only said that to comfort him. Oh, His so he's symptoms gonna die. resemble a fever, but something else is causing them. They seem more akin to a disruption in his psyche. Antipyretics won't be of much use. What do we do? Mr. Forest Watcher, you have to help him. If memory serves, a plant called Vasanti grass can help soothe the mind. A small number grow in arid deserts. They usually look like shriveled weeds, but can be revitalized with a splash of water. They're expensive and unable to grow in the Avidya Forest's climate, so I don't have any on hand. I'll ask the caravans. Go find Kale, have her prepare medicinal tools, and a set of traveling gear for me. All right. Thank you. Contaminated region, huh? Is that why you two are also here? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Nice touch of yours. Is it a new withering zone? This is yours. Look fluffy. Doesn't seem like one. Whether you look at scale, internal conditions, or resultant effects, they're completely different. The only thing they have in common is that they aren't welcome. This nuisance made itself home in the Avidya forest, so I can't turn a blind eye. We feel the same way. All right. Let's contact the caravans first and purchase some Vasanti grass. We can also ask about the contaminated region. There's no time to waste. We have to move quickly. Let's go. Buy Vasanti grass from a traveling merchant. Elazar is a true. Alright, uh, before. Wait, is there a Statue of the Seven near there? Kind of. Okay, so I'm going to go to the statue, turn into Dead Draculus, and then go into the city. Yeah, no. 
I do need to make sure that I, um, mark off, uh, areas where I find them. So I don't end up getting too far behind to where there's, like, a whole bunch of, of pins, and I'm like, uh, which, which, which one is that? Because, yeah, that's, that's just gonna be an absolute pain. Just trying to remember which ones I just got and which one is, is gonna be a pain. But, it'll be fine. This system works a little bit better than just going around blind and not marking them. Like, it's better to mark them and then eventually lose your place than it's not mark them at all. Because if you mark them, you at the very least know Excuse me. where you I'd collected like them. You just need to mark them off on the map. Do you have any? <sighs> I'm sorry, Mr. Forest Watcher, if you but don't mark we've them off been at all, then the you're just gonna be wandering days. around the entire area. Closed? Now that's odd. It's my first time hearing you say something like that. Uh, it's a long story. Some of our goods were stolen recently. They were mechanical parts that we got from the Academia. Although they're old models, they still fetch a good price on the market. Our caravans had to pull together Mora to afford those parts. Now that they've been lost, we'll likely come up short this trip. All the merchants talked it over and we decided to raise the prices of our remaining inventory. Until this plan takes effect, none of us can privately sell anything. I don't get it. If these goods are so important, then why not think of a way to get them back? Yeah. Raising prices won't solve anything. At best, you're shoving the consequences of the robbery onto your customers. Mr. Forest Watcher, yeah, it's not that, that we don't want to. Good. It's just the thief disappeared into the deepest parts of the forest. We asked around and... Apparently, the forest has been very unusual as of late. Anyone who goes in experiences mental anomalies. We can't keep waiting out here for the thief to come out. All we could do is come up with another solution. So the bandit hid in the contaminated region after stealing those mechanical parts. How many people were there in total? Were they not affected by the contaminated region? That crook came from the contaminated region. As for how many, uh, there weren't any people. No people? No what attacked people. you then? Or robbed you or whatever? Uh, even if I tell you, you might not believe me. Uh, oh, fine. So, the thief that stole our parts was a huge mechanical crab. What the huge heck? Mechanical the Avidia Forest has creatures like that? See any of the field guy. Uh, to be honest, I'd rather not think about it. It moved too skillfully to be new at this. It came out of nowhere. Before we could react, it swiped our goods and ran away. We were all shocked. By the time we came to our senses, the thief was already long gone. I see. If we help you retrieve your stolen goods, then business will return to normal? Seems so. Oh, but of course! Uh, not only that, but you'll become one of our caravan's VIPs on all future purchases of any... Uh... Enough. Tell me something that's actually useful. Any leads on that <laughs> mechanical crab? Maybe one. After our goods were stolen, we specifically got someone to assess the situation. If you're interested, you can go and talk to them. All right. We'll go and have a word. Talk to you, your closest. Okay. After the goods were stolen, I made multiple inquiries with nearby caravans and residents. It turns out that many others have also been robbed by that crooked crab. However, the crab only seems to be interested in machinery. It doesn't even bat an eye at other valuables. 
A caravan carrying a large amount of Mora had an uneventful trip, but another caravan had a child whose metal toy was taken. Whatever the case, that thing is a scourge. We'll eventually think of a way to get rid of it. Baby. And the best part about the mini Sealy is that, watch this, so the, the mini Sealy is there, right? If I so desired, I can have another uh, gadget equipped, since the Sealy doesn't count as a true gadget, I can have the Sealy and something else. And since I, I'm still going through the Aranyaka quest, I am having the liar. Wait, is that the, uh, the one that I've had, like, the entire time, or... Oh, wait, no, I, I need the vintage liar. Not the, not the other one. I need the vintage liar to play the, uh, the Aranara stuff. So let's, let's talk to the airline over here. That mechanical crab is fast, strong, and a pain to deal with. Ten of us might not even be able to take that thing head on. Didn't the academia ban research on mechanical life forms years ago? Where did that thing come from? Our salaries even got slashed because of it. Ugh. Who would have thought that that robber wasn't a human, but a mechanical crab? This is rough. Wait, hey, hold up. <laughs> I, just, I just saw something. Abdo has abs. I'm sorry. <laughs> that's just... That's, that's just my bi-anarchist self going crazy. Anyways, third person. I heard from the caravanners that there have been a lot of robbers. <laughs> the the are but evil. We haven't been affected. We don't normally Why? see the mechanical crab, and it doesn't disturb our daily lives. It only shows up when the caravans are here, and it runs back to the contaminated region after it's done making a mess. You haven't tried capturing it? We have, but it's too agile and fast. However, we did unexpectedly learn something the last time we tried to capture it. It apparently lives in the deepest part of the forest, so instead of immediately moving its spoils, it first hides them nearby. Once its stash grows large enough, it moves everything in one go. You'll have to move fast if you want those goods back. So we have all the information that we need, so let's talk to the merchant and see what we should do about this issue. How are things? Did you make any progress? Hello. We learned of its behaviors, but much still remains unclear. Assuming normal operational status, mechanical constructs generally act according to their given commands. If I were its owner, I'd command it to steal more valuable things. Or the mora you made. That would be the most efficient method. But it only goes after mechanical components. This doesn't make any sense. Yeah, something does not but seem, it's seem really quite, weird. quite right. So, you all found a way to retrieve our goods? Do I you have so. any more mechanical parts with you? Yes, I still have a small bag of samples. They weren't taken since I keep them on me at all times. Uh, can oh, I have them? are you planning to? Under constant external conditions, organisms rarely initiate changes in their habits. Here's what we know so far it has a mechanical composition, it lives in the contaminated region, and it comes out to steal mechanical components. If we have said components, we can lure it out capture it, and then make observations for further conclusions. Hmm. Hmm. Well, chatting like this won't get us anywhere. We're only wasting time. 
you're right. We don't have any other options right now. This bag of samples is all yours, Mr. Forest Watcher. If you can get our goods back, the caravans will reward you generously. We don't need anything in return, but I'll be keeping this bag. I may have other uses for it later. We'll also need to borrow a Sumter Beast. Our act has to be convincing if we want the crab to fall for it. Oh, yeah, no problem at all. If it means getting our things back, you can even borrow me to do whatever you need. <laughs> I'll have to decline that offer. Oh, anyway, we'll use the mechanical components and Sumter Beast to pose as a transiting caravan and lure out eh, the crab. Whatever. Once it appears, capture it. I leave the timing to you. Don't worry, we're professionals. Yeah, we've we've been doing this for almost a year. Uh, yeah, I go to the location where the robbery took place. Can I just teleport there? Eh, I'm just gonna move normally. I'm just I'm just gonna walk. It's not that far. Looking at the trade routes and the contaminated region's current perimeter, the goods were likely stolen somewhere around here. Then okay. let's get to it. We'll definitely capture that criminal crab. Okay. We'll start from here and have the Sumter Beast with the components on board lead the way. Okay. This Sumter Beast isn't familiar with us yet, so be calm and take your time with it. Okay. The Sumter Beast went ahead. Let's keep up with it. Huh? Uh, why did it stop? Hmm. Looks like it's loafing around. Or maybe it's hungry. The caravanners grew disheartened after their goods were stolen, so they probably didn't feed their animals as scheduled. Gosh. See, let's let's grab the uh, the Neo Apollo Lotus that we find along the way, so that in the event we ever do get Titanari, yeah, in the, in, in the event we ever do get Titanari, we'll have a bit of a leg up in terms of ascension. Strong, be careful. No. I am a Xiao main. We're almost never careful. We are reckless beings. Wait, I can just De decimation fields. Bang. Evil conquering. Worthless. Mechanical crab, so dubbed as the component thief. Worthless.
doesn't seem to understand us. Hmm, it doesn't seem capable of comprehending complex questions. Keep an eye on it. I'll search around the area for the caravan's goods. As long as you let me touch your ears afterward. I don't know why you're stealing mechanical parts, but they don't belong to you. Stolen items must be returned to their rightful owners. Any objections? That looks sad. You came from the depths of the contaminated region, right? How about you help us with something? If you take us there, I'll give you some mechanical parts as a reward. It reacted! Does it understand mm. us? I can't be certain yet. Its excitement may be a simple programmed response upon seeing mechanical components. Okay, so you want the crowd to lead us into the contaminated region? That's right. Seems the so. contaminated yeah. region has a large and currently expanding perimeter, so it would be difficult to conduct a thorough search. If we charge straight in, we'll get lost like headless pigeons. Also, our new friend here seems to be full of secrets. I've been studying this contaminated region recently, and I have a hypothesis of my own. So to be absolutely safe, it would be best to have a guide lead the way. So a guide is going to be the um, crab. Does this scuttler understand what you're saying? It doesn't have to, as long as it isn't hostile towards us. Makes I sense. gave it some components that it will definitely take back to the contaminated region. So long as it doesn't attack us, we can simply follow along. It seems to be really happy. Listen to me. Wait for us here. No running off. We'll be back soon. If you're still here when we return, I'll give you another mechanical part as a reward. Understood? This fat cat is understanding us. I'm not sure, but our priorities are to retrieve the mechanical components and to purchase Vasanti grass to make medicine with. We should return, but before we do, we need to set up a few traps. Can't have that crab escaping. Fair point. What happens if we walk into them? Nothing. Just nothing happens. Alright. Alright, so let's return the components to the merchant. And once we're done with that bit of dialogue, we can end stream. Because we are just about out of time. So. Oh! Oh! These are the mechanical parts that were stolen! You really got them back for us. We did indeed. Thank you all so very much. I don't know how I can repay you. Wait, didn't you want to purchase Vasanti grass? Don't yep. worry about the price. They're on the house. How many do you need? All of it. Two is enough. Fine. Yes. No, that won't do. Here, I'll throw in some more. No need. I've already received a reward from you. Reward? You mean that bag of mechanical parts? Ah, they aren't worth much compared to this merchandise. But those parts are very useful to me. Just like the Vasanti grass. I retrieved the things you needed, and you gave me what I needed in return. We're even. Oh, and before we go, just a reminder, the forest has an intricate and biodiverse ecosystem. 
Even if there were no mechanical crabs, other dangers are still present. Take caution on this route. Noted. Thank you all ever so much. Let's return to the village. The earlier we can give the child medicine, the sooner he'll start feeling better. Yep. Sadly, we are gonna have to wait to give Yara the uh, Asante Grass medicine stuff. Because we are just about out of time. Super quick. No, that's not what I wanted to press. <laughs> Hold on. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this stream and you're on the YouTube side of things, then please be sure to comment, like, subscribe, and as always, stay awesome. And if you're one of the lovely people who decided to take time out of your day, afternoon, or evening to come watch this stream live as it is happening, or you are here for the two weeks that it is on Twitch before I transfer it over, then please be sure to drop a follow and maybe even a sub if you so desire. And as always... Long live the rebellion.